is firmly on the processor without breaking, of course. That looks like it's pretty solid. There you go. And that's the best kind of connector connection. So it's nice and solid. Yep. Pretty solid at this point. And that's it. That's installed number one. Now since we did one, now we now let's do the other one. So here's go a little faster than the first. Now this thing also came with an Allen wrench and the reason you need the Allen wrench is because these four screws on the top of the water block that's what you unscrew and the whole thing comes apart so you can clean the inside of the water block which since we just got the water block it's fairly clean so we don't need to unscrew those so let's do this one more time That's one. That's two And now I'm just going to tighten them with your pliers. They recommend using needle nose for this, but these things are so tight, I don't know how you could possibly do this with needle nose pliers. And now we do the last one. the thermal grease, break the seal, there we go, put the grease right in the middle, what happened to the grease, it's not coming out, there we go, it looks like it was stuck. Take my plastic baggie, wrap my finger on it, and spread it around as evenly as I can, starting from the middle and going out. 
spreading it as even as I can across the entire surface area. film before use. So let's remove the film. Nice and shiny. There go. Nice and shiny surface. And we put it in the same configuration as the other water block. There we go. And then put in the plastic washers. There's one. There's two. There's three. And uh oh, where's the fourth one? Uh oh. Here's the fourth one. Okay. And then put in the four screws. Tight it all down. in all the way. Now let me tie it all down. Yep, looks like it's pretty uh, pretty tight there. So that's it. So let me stand this up, and here's what it looks like without the big heat sinks, but with the very cool Cool Ants CPU water blocks. So I uh, hope you had fun watching me install this. Uh, thanks for uh, subscribing to my channel and upcoming another video where I uh, start connecting some of these water blocks with tubes and more water cooling. So thanks and see you soon.